Hello and welcome. Today we're going to check out Hammer Helm. This is a game developed by Super Six Studios, all about running a clan of dwarves and building a, uh, a base. It's sort of a, a, a base builder uh, slash RPG, uh, I suppose. We're kind of the leader of this clan. We're going to be trying to build a town. Uh, but we also can take control of, of us and run around the land and do various jobs, kill goblins, that kind of a thing. These dwarves, however, are, are quite confused. They, um, something's wrong with these dwarves because the first line in the Steam page, let me read it to you, says, The dwarves of the Hammerhelm clan dream of living above ground, under the sun and clouds. So yeah, there's some sort of sickness has run through this dwarven community that has made us want to live above ground for some reason. Either that or Super Six Studios is very confused <laughs> about what dwarves do. Uh, they sent me a key to show this one off, so let's go ahead and do that and uh, and try it out. I'm always up for a game with dwarves, confused or not. We'll play a, a game with some dwarves and, and some town building. So we'll, we'll choose our dwarf and who we look like and, and all of that. It's not a whole lot of choosing we can do here, but we can uh, we can change our, our look of our hair and uh, our hair color if we want. But yeah, we're, we're good. Change our beard style. Ooh, look at that one. Oh, my. Uh, my name's going to be... Tourist. Or where's the confused? All right, so let's build this thing up and uh, and check it out. So this has been in early access for I think about a year now, and it's been sort of slowly coming along in in development. But uh, yeah, so here is us. This is Urist here on on the first person point of view. Well, third person point of view in our uh, will soon to be home spot. We can go to P as you can see over here, and we go into build mode. Build mode is, we can see, this is us right here. You can kind of see us over right there. And this is our grid of where we can place our stuff. So we're in we're in town building mode at the moment. So we can go over here and build ourselves a stock house, a storehouse, and place it down where we want to go. We'll put it down well, right there. Okay, then we'll put in a, uh, a wooden house. Uh, let's um, craft one of these guys. We'll set it, let's just rotate it around and put it, I don't know, right right there. This white spot here is our, uh, our road. Uh, my town will be called... Um, confused dwarf land. Okay, now we get to choose two people to come join us. We have Bertry, uh, who's a brawler and is is messy, is always getting dirty and needing new clothes. And we have uh, Gary or Jerry, claustrophobic and a foodie. And we have Eighth Bert, who uh, is fast and weak. Mm. Weak cannot carry a lot of resources. Well, I guess we're gonna take Gary and Bertry. Sorry, weak dwarves, not allowed. I draw a line somewhere. All right, so let's go back into uh, into first-person mode. So here we go. So we look around, and there are the buildings we just placed. And you can see our workers, old, uh, old Birdie. I'm going to call her Birdie. Birdie and what's-his-face are, are here, working away, building our, our town. And they will actually, you can see it, actually, it's it's becoming a town. We can actually go inside these buildings in a bit. Uh, we're going to talk to old Birdie here. Hey, Birdie. Hello, Erst. Is there something I can help you with? Uh, my name's Marty. I am a worker. I can gather wood or stone. Well, um, go ahead and keep getting wood. It's fine. But I uh, I have orders to ask for a quest from you. This is our perfect spot to build our town, but I saw some goblins to the east. They didn't look friendly. I don't think the way they looked really matters. I'm going to kill them either way. So let's come over here. Let's go to I. Let's put out the old uh, the old basic sword. See, I, remember? Com confused dwarves. We don't have war hammers or axes. We have swords because we're very, we're very confused. We don't know what's going on. Um, so yeah, let's run over this way and uh, go. You can see my mini map up there is, is pointing me in this direction, telling me where the uh, the goblins be, and there be goblins right here. So here's how we attack. We can just left click attacks, middle click we we'll use as a power attack, and right click will block for us. Uh, we can also dodge if we wish, but uh, we don't do dodging. We may be confused, but uh, we're not gonna be that confused. So we can block that way. We can smack that way. Like that? Well, I took some damage. Maybe we should, maybe we should learn to uh, block. Let's do dodge. Oh, look at that. It is dodging. Okay, okay, okay. So, oh, look at that. Yeah. All right, we'll smack this guy around. Maybe. Uh, my my sword over there is, is sort of building up energy. Oh, it, is, it is. It was. And we can go with a power attack and thwack him. Does my block work? Yeah, there we go. Power attack. There we go, buddy. Take that. G opens the chest. We get some copper ore and some leather. These are resources that we'll use. We'll see in a minute. We'll be able to go back and build more buildings to our town, add more people into our town, and get things working. They're going to go around doing various jobs, like gathering wood or stone or whatever they need to do. Um, I actually took a bit of a beating there. Let's go up there and grab that, and we can drink up some potion. 
and get some hit points here. So again, we've got another camp over this way. We must we must kill, find three monster camps near town and destroy them. Okay. Come here, buddy. Whoa! Oh. Oh, 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 you hit me? No, you didn't. My guy's got a purple belt. Right? He's somebody important. Well, oh, I didn't get my block up fast enough. Oh, apparently my swing didn't work because I hit the scroll up instead. Middle mouse button is a strange place to put a power attack. All right. Open the chest. Sure, I'll take more leather. Excellent. And some gold. Uh, we got one more camp to get to. Let's go ahead and go get it. And go grab these guys. And uh, finish this one up. So this is, yeah, sort of going through the tutorial here. Trying to figure out what's going on. This way. Grab that guy. There we go. Yeah, you know what? Let's, uh, let's not get hit so much this time. Wow, how, did I, how did I miss you? There we go. Oh, yeah, these things are really easy. I just have to move out look a little bit. Okay, okay. We used to be able to go toe-to-toe -to -toe with goblins. Well, at this time, did I hit both of you? Oh, I just hit the one. Okay. Oh, I'm going to die here. Smack this guy around. There we go. Okay. Give me your chest. Excellent. I will loot all of it. I'll go ahead and hit a potion. We have... Something has the workers too scared to enter the storehouse. Investigate it. Right. Dwarves are always frightened of things in buildings. Let's go see what's wrong. Maybe maybe we're just halflings with beards. We just we just call ourselves dwarves. Maybe that's what's going on. Something is, Something's going on. <laughs> Let's run over this way. And... Uh, See what's wrong with the old town. The town should actually be reasonably built, however, over here. Uh, I'm running at the moment. My stamina is going down. It should be probably completed, but we can eventually go and start digging into the mines and digging underground. We can build, like, walls around our town and, and prevent, I believe, attacks and all that coming at us. So, all right, you cowardly dwarves. What's going on over here? Yes? What's the matter? What's the matter? Is it is it this one here? Into the storehouse we go. Oh, look, we got ghosts. You don't hit too hard. Power attack. I wish I could hit both of you with my power attack. It looks like it looks like it cleaves you. Oh, I wasted it. There we go. Okay. Give me the chest. And you had just some gold. Okay. And yeah, there's the gold. Uh, that's right. We have things in here. Let me go ahead and get my potion. Uh, press B to open the build menu and uh, place another house and a metal worker shop and wait for them to be constructed. Okay. Let's build another house. So back up to the town. Over this way. Let's go put our house in here. I'm going to put it over here next to the other one. Like that. There goes a tree down because someone's chopping. Uh, we get one. Oh, we get two more people. Philium, a pacifist. Um, we have our floy is a green thumb and a mole. She loves to grow crops, but hates to be in the mines. Loves being in the mines or underground. I think she's the most confused one I've ever seen, so let's take her. <laughs> uh, he's always getting dirty and needing new clothes. He's weak, cannot carry a lot of resources. Does not like to fight or harm others. Not implemented yet. Okay, that sounds like something we want. It is more likely to be in a good mood. All right, Philium, come along and be happy. You, weak, get out. All right, and what else are we supposed to build? A, a metal worker shop? All right, let's build this thing. So, yeah, so, of course, this is an early access, and uh, it has a little ways to go, obviously. But let's place this thing down and um, go check out the old town here. Uh, wait for them to be constructed. Okay, we're, we're waiting. We're waiting. Uh, hey, hey, Gary. How's it going? I don't want to talk. Uh, can I talk to Gary? Hey, Gary, I can't talk to you. You got a limp there, Gary. What's wrong? Good job destroying those goblins. I'll be able to work faster knowing they're gone. Well, yeah, you know, my name's Gary. I'm a worker. I can gather wood or stone. All right. Bye, Gary. Get your leg checked out, buddy. Are we done? Are they Are they good? Shift V to open the town menu and assign a metal worker once the Wendell Shorter shop is complete. Okay. Shift V. Uh, we're going to have... Who wants to go do it? The, um, the pacifist? Yeah, Philium. Can I put you... into the metal worker shop? There we go. Speak to the metal worker about crafting copper items. So, uh, where are you at? Uh, what was his name? The happy guy. I don't know what his name was. Let's go find him. He's going to be in the metal worker shop, which I think we just walked away from. Let's go over here. Hey, buddy. Um, Philium. Yeah, yeah, yeah. How's it going, buddy? Press T. Hello, Erst. Is there something I can help you with? Uh, my name's Philium. I am a metal worker. I can craft items using leather and various ore. I also brew potions. Would you like me to craft something for you? I would. Can you make me 
a copper item. Thanks for uh, building the shop. I can craft better items for you if you find some copper ore. The mine entrance is blocked, but I know where you can find some ore nearby. Mine three copper ore deposits near town. All right. Let's go do that. We got old uh, Gary out here. He's out chopping some trees down. So there's, a, I think, a, the mine entrance is right there. I do believe is what that is. Can I, um... I don't think I can do anything with this. There's copper deposits around here somewhere? Okay, let's go find them. I'm not sure if there's evil things that come out at night. I'm sure there are. What is that? Oh, that's a copper deposit right there. Let's use the old, you know, the thing that all dwarves use. A sword to wail away on this copper ore and give us some copper ore. We need, we need, uh, what? Two remaining copper ones, okay. Uh, I saw one earlier. Where'd it go? Where'd it go? Where'd it go? Oh, there it is. There it is. Okay, let's go get it. Come here, copper. Does wonders, uh, wonders to the sword. Sharpness is what's going on here. You go and you wail away on a copper mine, and your sword comes out blisteringly sharp. Okay, there we go. Job done. Uh, craft new item at the metal worker shop. Okay, let's go do that. Let's run back over there and, and, uh, and make some things. So yeah, so clearly pretty early access, but it's uh, potentially something. I thought something rather interesting. The the uh, the whole build a town and RPG kind of thing is is rather unique. Um, this is available on Steam. I'll have a link below, of course. You can check the thing out if you wish. Let's go talk to the old Philium. Philium, the happy one, about uh, making me some some things. Philium, I like to craft. All right, so we are going to make. What are we making? What's our job here? Craft a new item. Anything. Okay. I can do that. I would like. So I've got 38 ore. i got to make some bars, right? How do we make bars? Here they are. So I'll make some bars. I think we just click a bunch. So make a whole bunch of bars. We can get... What's that? Like 20 of 19 of those things. And we can make... We make a copper hammer here. We have leather. Sure, let's do that. Excellent. We can make a... Oh, we can't make an axe. We're just short of that. I need an axe. We got a new job here, though. A copper horned helm. Let me see what my job is first. Speak to Barty and clear the mine entrance. Uh, sure. Barty, where are you? Barty, whatever your name is. Bertry. Can you go, uh, can you clear those mines out? I can clear the mines first for you. Give me a moment. All right. Get to work. Where aren't you going? Get to work. Get to work. All right, she's confused. All right, buddy. I'd like to craft some more. I want to make... There she goes. Now she's going. Uh, I would like to make a shoulder armor. I want a helmet. Let's make one of those. Put that thing on the old head. Yes, there we go. Uh, a hammer does do more damage. So, right? 38 versus 25. So, there we go. Now we got our proper weapon. Much better. I can build a better shield. Uh, I can get some mushrooms. I guess to make some spam stamina potion. Torches we can make. Uh, we can make all kinds of things here. Copper axe display. All right, a bloodstone sword display. That seems exciting. Oh, look at my head. Birdie, did you get it? What are you standing around for? Is this your house? Thanks for getting rid of those ghosts in the storehouse. Well, you're welcome. You weren't here yet, though. My name's Orfloy. I am a worker. I can gather... Yeah, whatever. So, uh, enter, enter the... And clear the mines near town so you can begin gathering stone. Okay, did you get it? Good job, Birdie. Let's go. Time to destroy... Whatever lurks. Whatever evil things lurk in here. Probably, I don't know, things like gnomes or something. Been a long time ago. These mines are now home to many vile creatures. Before your townspeople can begin mining here, they must make it safe. Oh, they're mushroom people. Of course they are. Oh, oh. Yep, you swing, you miss. Okay. The old big... Yeah, there we go. Hey, hey, hey. Watch it, buddy. Gnawing on my kneecaps. There we go. Okay. Anyone else? Anyone else want some? Anybody else? Let's uh, let's hammer away here with our uh, with our with our hammer. Get some uh, some iron. Is that what this is? Oh, more copper. Okay. Clear the mine so you can begin gathering stone. Yep. Yeah. I'm gonna gather stone right now. Game. We got more mushroom people up here. Let's go deal with them. Anybody else? No. Just the two of you? Alright, I can handle you. 
How does my shield do? My shield does do all right. There we go. And on you. Okay. I need more potions. I'm uh, I'm I'm doing a poor job of, of walking away, but I don't need to. It's fine. We can just smack them. We can take some damage. Grab some more copper, I'm guessing is what this is. Yes, more copper. Excellent. We will have ourselves a... Um, I guess I don't... What, do I need an axe if I have a, a, a hammer? Maybe it's a different kind of damage. Is that in the game? Or is it just there for looks? Did you try biting me? Okay. Dropping a chest, are you? No, you're not. Well, let's keep on going here. Clean out these mines. we got two monsters left, and there they are right there. Hey, buddy. Oh, that was bad. I'm new to this being a, a whole dwarf thing. Excellent. One down. Try to bite. Nope. Excellent. There we go. I will. Ah! None of that. None of that. What do we get? Oh, we got some mushrooms. Of course we did. We're going to eat the poor guys. And it looks like there's some copper over here. I will grab some of that. Leave the mines, press shift V to open the town menu and assign a miner. Can I do it right now? Shift V. I want to assign uh, somebody over here. I'm going to assign the messy one. The claustrophobic one. I should, I send, should I send Gary in here? Um, or maybe the mole. She hates being underground, but she likes being underground. Yeah. You go do that. <laughs> Alright, let's get out of here. Okay. Back outside. Now go back into town. What's my next uh, next job here? Hey, 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 there you go. Go uh, go get some work. Can I talk to you? Mining. Oh, I can tell you to yeah, mine copper. Yes. Good job. Hey, thanks. Go get him. Let's go back over here. Can I craft something else? We can go to P to the build menu. If we want to build any more houses. Let's see what else we can get here. We've got, uh, we need, I guess, iron for the, is that what that is? Iron? For those, can I make anything here? I can make a metal workshop. shop. We've already got those. We can do a farm next, I suppose. Uh, we got a, uh, a mission to do. Oh my, what is Is that iron? Find the cave near town and clear it. Well, I don't need to find it because it's right there yelling at me. But let's first talk with old Philium here. And uh, make something else. It's not actually, that's not iron. I don't know what that is. Maybe some sort of fabric. Make some of these and let's craft. A, um, what do you do, Copper Axe? Uses more stamina for smash attack, but does less dash, less for dash attack. How about... I can afford a Copper Shield, but I don't ever use my shield, so maybe we should just get some armor. Like some... This is a bracer. How about uh, some shoulders? And some bracers. There we go. Oh, we need two. Right, right. I have two shoulders. There we go. Okay. Looking good. Oh, yeah, looking very good. All right, buddy, where is this cave at? Let's go find it. Find a cave and clear it. Okay. I'm guessing the clay is going to have... Whatever that is. Can I... Uh, I can't use a cursor to really move that. Confu <laughs> um, confused dwarf line. It has 13 of, of something white. Some sort of cloth that I need to make farms. I have a feeling it's going to be my next step. Uh, well, that's convenient. Whoever owns this cave put torches outside. Cave of emptiness. Looks newly inhabited, so it's not so empty. Sense of evil permeates every crevice. Be wary. Oh, more mushroom people, eh? Um, one second, drop mushroom people. There we go. I'm glad the red guy decided to wait his turn. Sometimes they, they swing real quick, and other times they, they wait a long time. Okay, got him. Find the cave near town and clear. Okay, we just have to make sure we get everything cleaned out. This is an exciting cave. What's going on over there? Alright, mushroom people. I'm ready for you. Come here. Can I, like, maybe, uh, work the system here and get you kind of behind this wall? 
I don't want to fight both of you. Ow. There we go. There we go. There we go. You watch out, buddy. Oh yeah, there's a whole other way way down there. Uh, we'll go ahead and grab this uh, this copper while we're here. Like that, and let's go this way and see what we can find over here. Hello, welcome to my uh, my new home, which you are living in. Ow! Oh, one hit. I got three hit points. Uh, let me run away. Drink one of these. Done. What do we get? Uh, oh, more mushrooms. Can I um, use to brew potions? Right. Can we go uh, maybe talk with our uh, our brewmaster and see if that will give us some... Um, maybe we can make something cool with that? Maybe some health potions? Because we are all out. Let's go over this way. Someone put a, put a bridge in here. How far does this go? I wonder if by doing this, am I am I taking all the copper out of here? So if I send someone over here to come do some mining, am I uh, neglecting, am I making them not have a job? Surely not. There we go. Okay. Back out. Uh, next job, please. I'm ready for more. We never found any of the, whatever that, that uh, fabric stuff was. Can I uh, help chop down a tree? I can't. Find the dungeon near town and destroy it. Alright, let's go get ourselves a dungeon. Why stop at caves when there be dungeons about? I'm wondering if we... Um, let me see something real quick. We're going to pee mode. If I put down another house, can I? No, they all take that, that white stuff. Whatever that is, they all take that. So we can't put any of those things in there. So let's go see if we take out this dungeon, if it'll give us what we want. Let's just go look at the dungeon anyways. Let's see what it wants. I notice everyone has a mood above their head. I'm not entirely sure how to uh, adjust that. If it has to do with uh, making sure they're fed and, and all that. I'm not entirely sure. Let's go see what this dungeon is all about. If it's filled with mushroom people or something else. Something else. Something other vile things out there. Head on over this way, and, um... Hello, dungeon. Do you have torches outside as well? Because it makes things really easy. There you are. Oh, you do? Wow, well, thanks! I really appreciate that. Wherever the owners of these places are, are quite... quite welcoming. Alright, to the dungeon. Dungeon of curses. Seems ancient. You can hear the creatures moving about. Be on your guard. I can break chests. What's in here? Anybody? Ah, skellies! Hello, friend. Well, you have a sword. Okay. Two swings in a block. Remember that. Oh, I did. I blocked you. Hmm. All right. Um, ooh, look at that guy. Is he on fire? No, there's a, just a thing behind him. Right, so we're going to have to do three of them here, and I got no healing potions. Nice of them to come at me one at a time. Oh, why can't I swing? Oh, why can't I? Why can't I swing? Uh, all right, game. <laughs> I feel like the game froze up. I couldn't swing. Okay, now what happens if I die? Excellent qu- Oh. Um, buddy. Wake up, buddy. Okay, okay, okay. We're good. We're good. <laughs> okay. Okay, so this is Hammer Helm. I'm gonna call it a day here. Uh, again, this is on Steam. It's in early access. Very early access. Uh, but I'll have a link below and you can check the thing out. Thanks again for watching. And I will see you next time. Actually, you know what? Before we go, let me go look inside your house. Birdie, you mind this? 
Oh, nice place you got here. Is this your, uh, this your rug you sleep on? It's quite nice. Almost as good as mine. Alright, <laughs> I'll see you next time.